Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. We got tag team action happening here, and I'm fired up. It's crucial for a team to get out in front early. That way they can set the tone for the match. Three! Look at this. Well, we're on the move here. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. When you're in the ring with Enzo Amore, you have to look out for well, those lightning fast feet, including when you're on the offensive. I mean, he's incredibly tough to catch. Well, on the topic of Enzo Amore here, well, tell us your thoughts. Give us your thoughts about Enzo Amore. I like the pairing, Michael. These two work so well together as a team. As you know, we're talking about someone with a lot of talent. I'm not so sure I like the idea of it being showcased in a tag team. You gotta let talent like that shine on its own. He's simply reminding him that he's here. to avoid that he makes the tag we've talked about enzo amore's quick feet he can also take to the air and deliver quite a drop kick which we've seen on several occasions yeah speaking of taking to the air i get dizzy just thinking about enzo's head scissors from our vantage point it doesn't even look like a sweat has been broken Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. Colin Cassidy feeling the lockup. It's an amazing atmosphere in this arena tonight. Oh, you're right. Big fight feel here, no doubt. Colin Cassidy feeling the lockup. You have to respect that Kevin Owens knows what he wants and goes right after it. He's one of the most no-nonsense competitors we've seen in a long time. Yeah, but I'm not so sure Sami Zayn respects that. Kevin Owens wanted Zayn's NXT title and cut to the front of the line in February 2015 to take it. He gets the tag. That landed perfectly. And he finally gets out of the ring. We're looking at complete domination here. You'd have to think that Kevin Owens' brawling style makes him incredibly difficult to game plan for. You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Not today. Too fast. Back pain could be dull, achy, sharp, or stabbing. This might be a case of all the above. I agree. Dull, achy, sharp, and stabbing. It won't take long for the aggression to escalate quickly in this one. You're right, Cole. These two don't like each other. And we're going to find out how much they really do dislike each other in this match. To your earlier point, Cole, there's no game planning for a guy who's going to come right at you like Owens does. The only thing I can think of is maybe run. He's too good inside the ring to be out on the floor for long. I don't agree with you, Kank. He gets the tag. He's seen enough. Here he comes. Why well, is the guy his opponent and what's he going for here? Ooh, nothing pretty about that. We've seen some great... Hey, the shoulders are down! A lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter, but only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for. The win. Quick 
thinking to avoid that. The rate in which this young man, Colin Cassidy, is improving is unreal. It's this if he gets better and better with each passing week. He keeps up at this rate, there's no telling how far Big Cass can go. And at nearly seven feet tall, the sky is the limit. There's no quit in these guys, but unfortunately only one of them can be victorious here tonight. Two. One. Man, Chris Jericho, what offense. I'm not sure I can watch this. Two. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. John, earlier you mentioned Colin Cassidy's size is one of the reasons for his success, and I don't disagree, but equally important to his success, I think, was his upbringing on the mean streets of Queens, New York. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. And he brings the action back inside the ring. Yeah, I, I, I think this is good strategy. Inside the ring now. Finally. Let's get this done inside the ring. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. Colin Cassidy certainly has street smarts, as you noted, Cole. But you know what else he has? The East River Crossing. I mean, you get hit with that bad boy, and the match is over. No questions asked. Oh! DDT! This guy's just too strong! Oh, going to the top. High risk. Watch out! I mean, that's how you pick your moment and go for it. Wow, he's still down after that. We're looking at complete domination here. If this stretch doesn't get broken soon, it can have terrible lasting effects. Oh no, Enzo Amore looking to finish it. We're looking at complete domination here. That's it, he's out. Strikes like that can end this one in a hurry. You know, I've heard Kevin Owens tell people to trust him on more than one occasion. To be honest with you, I'd shake hands with him, but I'd count my fingers afterwards. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Oh man, how do you stand after an attack like this? He looks absolutely unstoppable here. All these power moves tonight are making bigger and bigger impacts. Not this. He's looking at it again. He's making a statement here with this attack. Uh-oh. Look at this. It's all academic from here. Quickly back to the topic of trust. I'd say Sami Zayn trusted... Ke the shoulders are down. Oh, and he's going to have to do something big here. His partner is in bad shape. The referee getting involved now. Look out! Kevin Owens hit that one. There's the finishing move. Can he score the pin? One, two, three. They did it! They won the match! Oh, those WWE competitors tore this arena apart. You want to talk about incredible high-impact sports entertainment? Check out what happened during this match. Oh boy, that was a spectacular performance. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. Here are your winners, Chris 
Jericho and Kevin Owens. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to everyone. I love tag team matches, and that was one of the best I've seen in a while. Oh, when you bring such a high level of